guys, it's Sarah from We Are Twin Set here. I'm flying solo today, Phil's is unable to make it, but I'm really, really, really excited because we, I, I keep saying we, I'm filming at the Anine Bing store. Now, I wore one of the t-shirts a couple of weeks ago on Instagram and we were chatting saying, we've got to go to the store, We're, we love Anine Bing and we still haven't been to the store. And you guys were like, go to the store, film there, tell us what it's about so I'm super excited as you can tell I'm in the car we're gonna be heading into the store and seeing the new collection I'm gonna try on some of the pieces I'm so excited because I own a t-shirt I own two t-shirts and actually two blazers but I've never tried on any of the other pieces so I'm gonna take you with me and we're gonna have fun shopping guys so I'm here and I'm still as I said really really excited and for those of you that don't know just a little background on Anina Bing she is a model, blogger, turn designer with the best style. I think she's one of my style icons. Definitely got a bit of a girl crush. She kind of loves those rock chicky blazers, those rocky tees and the perfect denims. So I'm really excited to try on some of her pieces today. And of course, I'm taking you with me. So let's go in right now, come on. So I'm really, really chuffed to have a look at it today. That looks like it's going to be the most perfect shape. I wonder how many in the big t-shirts is too many. I think it's acceptable maybe to have like three. What do we think? You know when you've been looking for that perfect grey jumper for so long? I feel like that might be the answer to my grey jumper request. Now I've actually never tried on one of their famous kind of v-neck tees and what I love Obviously you can't feel it, is that it's really, really soft and it's a little bit sheer. So with a little bralette underneath, I'm definitely gonna give that a go. So these are the Stevie boots, and I would say her famous boot style. Now I don't know if any of you saw on Instagram, but Nina actually wore these with the tux to a fashion event and it was literally a dream look. So I'm going to obviously try them on to try to be like her. But I also love the classic black and the shape, can you see, is just it's like the perfect point with the perfect heel height. Like day, they'd be comfy enough and for the night as well. Okay, wait, I know, I know I'm obsessing over the silver, but how are you are those? Absolutely love those. I'm gonna try them both on and I might just have to buy one. Okay, I've gone through two rounds and I've already picked up my eight pound things. Now, I've never tried it on one of their brothers either, so I'm really excited to try that under a t shirt. It's for you. I know you've got your eye on this, and I know you can't be here today. I'm going to try it on for you, and I'm sure I'm going to love it, and there's only one. So, <laughs> so I've been told I need to smell this candle. Savage Rose, that is. Yeah. <laughs> How good is that? And also, perfume oil. So you don't spritz, you kind of rub it on. I have only got one hand, but I did smell it before. Yeah, exactly. So nice. Now, is it normal? I'm meant to be trying on a few things, and this is how much stuff I've got, and I'm still going. So come on. Right, go to change the I can actually bear more, and I feel like I've missed things, I'm going to have to go back out. But it's time to try on. So this is called the Dylan coat and it also comes in navy. But the camel for me, I just feel like I could wear it in so many different ways. And I think that's what's amazing about all the Alina Bing stuff is that they're kind of these wardrobe staples that you can literally wear with so many different things. And that's what makes them just so, just you want them so much because I could wear, dress this up, dress this down. This t-shirt with the black and the red and the white, I could wear it in so many different ways. It's so comfy and the material is so soft. Absolutely loving the number one. Right, yeah. Yeah. There it is. Yeah, nice. yeah. I've never worn a t-shirt before. Thank you. I genuinely love it. 
These are the Etta jeans. They're kind of like a straight, almost like a bit of a wider leg. And I love the high rise, good for a mum tum. And the shape at the bottom, it's like every kind of, the way they fit just feels so nice. And just with a classic white tee and a blazer. I really love this look as well. I'm in such trouble. So this is their classic blazer, which I have in a che two checks actually. And I love the shape, it's really flattering with this one button detail. And it's kind of a good length, as you can see, it just covers the bum. And it's just the shape, the shoulders and the sleeves, which you can roll up, it just feels, it just fits perfectly. It just feels, I just feel nice. I mean, could I love any of it anymore? And please, can we just talk about the boots? I'm not sure if Philippa was here that she would totally get these because I'm the more of the glitter one in our relationship. But with such a simple outfit, I feel like we just kind of make the pop. I'd love to know your thoughts below because I'm kind of in love with this whole look. I love this jacket because I like my houseware. So this is like a brown and grey check. Now I saw it on a friend in red, which must have been the season four and I loved it and I was way too late because what I love about Anine Bing is they only buy like a few of each piece so it feels quite like you've got your hands on something when you do find it, it feels like no one else is going to have it. Um, and this is the new season brown version. And I've had a bit of a love affair with brown this season and this is like the perfect mix. Love it with the jeans and instead of a t-shirt I've gone for this cami which although feels quite dressy, I quite like the slouchy jacket with the more dressier cami and just another pair of these boots. This time, they've got studs on. And I think it's something about the point and the heel that just make them, they kind of feel like they're just going with anything. So this is look number three, and I equally am obsessed with this. So, and can you see the little leather detail at the back? It's so cute. And even like the buttons are lovely. And I love that kind of shape on the shoulders. Because you could it could be too boxy, but actually the proportions, you can really tell that she kind of works on her proportions because these proportions, you, you could look too wide and it just works perfectly. Enjoying this silky shirt and leather jacket that is such a cute length. Do you know what's nice about this? It's really soft and pyjama like, but it's still got the collar, which I really love. I mean, how many times can I say I really love? Because I've genuinely never been into a shop and loved everything I tried on. And there hasn't been one item so far that I haven't loved. I would say she's quite famous for her leather jackets. And this is stiff, but so soft. So you feel like you're just going to get better and better with age. Again, the shape with the shoulders and the crop length. And I love the crop length with something a bit longer hanging out. And this kind of zebra-y beige is her new kind of spring summer print, which I'm very much enjoying. And again, like this shirt. With jeans now, I could dress it up with a slip skirt, I could wear it kind of open with a cami. It's just so versatile, and you could wear it out as well. So it's a good length if you prefer to wear it with a skinny jean, but I've obviously got it half tucked today, which is kind of how I would wear it. And just layered with like gold necklaces and a pair of boots, it just feels very really comfortable. It's, it's always good to feel comfy with clothes. So it's another yes for me for this gorgeous silky shirt and the dreamy leather jacket. So I always see Anina being on Instagram with the most insane sunglasses selection. I'm not sure how good they're going to look on me, but oh, I don't know. Yeah? Do I nearly look like Anina Bing? Maybe a simpler black pair, but the shape is really nice. So this is the shirt without the jacket. I just wanted to show you the shape. It's just so effortless. You kind of roll the sleeves up, half tuck. It's really silky and as I said, I feel like there's so many different ways to wear it and I'm really... I haven't actually bought a shirt or even been drawn to a shirt in a really long time. And for some reason, I think it's the combination of the print and the kind of the cute pockets and just really enjoying this. Also, if you did want to go for the whole set, I don't know, would I go, would I try this? I think it might be a bit much, but separately, maybe with like a t-shirt and a leather jacket, that's really cute. And then for those that wear shorts, yeah, fill up with these a few. What's the coziest 
the most lovely grey jumper. And I've got these Etta jeans back on here, I love it. And I had to put the silver glittery boots back on. Couldn't keep away. This is just a really casual kind of laid back look. But you still feel like these are really luxe pieces, just this really soft and really comfy. You can tell that she kind of makes them with like you in mind, just to be really comfortable and cozy and you just want to wear them time and time again. I've come back out wearing stuff because I feel like I haven't tried enough stuff on, so I'm back for round two. I've got my eye on this slip dress. And I'm thinking of just a white tee and maybe the navy coat over the blue really I wasn't supposed to be trying on anything else apart from the dress, but I didn't see this jumper on my first look around. And I don't know if it's the colour of grey, or if it's the shape, or it's just the thickness of kind of the neck and the sleeves. So comfy, but so stylish and chic at the same time. And I've got back on the Etta jeans and the red boots, and I feel like this is an outfit I would just, I could literally wear anywhere, and I feel so comfortable in it, as I've said about 20,000 times. I feel chic, but I feel relaxed. And I think another thing about these pieces is that they are a bit dressy, but you don't feel too done, and that is definitely a hate of mine. I hate getting dressed in the morning and feeling too done. Whereas these pieces, I've got that luxe edge, but you feel kind of cool and casual at the same time. And I definitely say that's kind of a Mila Bing style, is that kind of relaxed, cool, casual vibes. And you really feel that when you try on clothes. And I hope you guys are getting that from the video as well, that I'm genuinely loving all these pieces because you're going to see them coming up on Instagram and YouTube soon. I genuinely have gone crazy in a Nina Bing. And this jumper jeans and boots. I feel like this, this look, I think, albeit simple, and albeit I've said it for every other look, this is this is me down to a tee. Dreamy white tee and bralette. So I really want to try on this slip skirt. And I love it with the navy coat. Okay, this is the same as the cashmere. Same as the cashmere, same as the camel, cashmere one in navy. And I feel like sometimes it's a bit softer than black, but you can wear it equally with black. And I just think that with the slip skirt, with the white, black, and navy, and the little bralette, it just looks really cute. And again, I think this coat looks equally nice, kind of like belted. So, what I love about this skirt is that it flicks out a bit at the bottom, and quite a lot of them are straight down. And sometimes, if you've got kind of more curves, it's not as flattering. Whereas this one, with the slight flick out and the length, is really flattering. I just love it, kind of team, just really simple and minimal. Just how Anina Bing wears all her pieces, just kind of all thrown together in the most natural way, and it just feels done. And that I think is definitely what I've learned from trying everything on today is just you really can take each of these pieces and pretty much wear them with everything in store. It's that real kind of casual, wholesome wardrobe, which kind of is what we're all about and is what she's all about. And I am just obsessed with everything and loved everything. And it's been such a treat to kind of come here today, try on all these pieces and create my crazy wish list, which I don't know how I'm going to afford to buy everything, but you know, a girl can dream. And a big thank you to Anina Bing for having me. It was the best dreamiest morning. It was so fun to see the new collection, try everything out, and just to see and feel all the fabrics and try on the sizes because I had only ever said, as I said, I had a t-shirt and a blazer and I got to try on everything. It was a dream come true. I literally loved everything. And I'm guilty as charged. I've done some damage, so it's time for me to head off. And a big thank you for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Um, we'd love to hear your thoughts below. Give us any feedback. Um, give us a thumbs up if you like the video. And we'll see you this time next week at 7.30 on Sunday. Bye.